Alright guys, welcome back to a short update on what is now Hurricane Bonnie um, in the Eastern Pacific. Yes, the crossover storm has become a hurricane a lot earlier than expected actually. Um, currently, I believe by the NHC to have wind speeds of... Um, let's just have a look here with the five day and start to track 80 miles an hour. So the NHC have it with wind speeds of 80 miles an hour. They're expecting it to peak as a category two hurricane. Um, expecting it to keep hurricane status for mighty long, actually. But um, the satellite imagery, I guess you could say it's worrying, but I'm very confused about the satellite imagery. So I'm just going to show you it. And um, you could see it is there is an eye there. But is it an eye? Like, it came out of nowhere when it was rebuilding convection. So I believe it is going to start firing convection over that. Or that may just be a dry spot invasion. And it may have just had a dry air invasion um, as well. So let's have a look at the intensity models here. Take a look at what intensity the storm looks like it's going to go up to. They've definitely backed down quite a bit now, as you can see. Um, going for a Cat 3 peak. And it looks like most models are going for Cat 1 to high-end Cat 1 as of now. Um, then they're probably going to keep it at that um, as well. And let's just end it with some geo satellite imagery, um, on, well, visible imagery of uh, Hurricane Bonnie. And I'm not used to saying that at all because I did not expect it to get to Hurricane as quick as it had. But anyway, thank you for watching this short update on Hurricane Bonnie. It was just to let you know that it has now become a hurricane and could potentially become a Category 2. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next update. Peace out.